Here's how you use Boss Jock Studio. First and foremost, push the mic button to bring the mic live. And you'll see when you push the mic button, the master fader here switches to mic control. That allows you to set the gain. You can turn it down, you can make it louder, and if you push it, you can notice that it's affecting the dynamics of the microphone. And you can always reset it by double clicking. Now the carts, let's listen to some tunes. Now just like the microphone, when the cart is playing back, you'll see that the uh, master fader takes over cart. Volume control duties. Just like the microphone, you double tap it to get it back to the default. And also you notice when you push the microphone, the cart's polite enough to duck into the background. It also allows you to use the, uh, the mic button for dramatic effects like music swells for very important parts of your podcast. And also there's fades on the cards, so uh, you can fade them into each other. If you want to kill a card early, it'll have a nice polite fade on it. I like the bleeps and the blops. And that's basically how you use Boss Chalk. You got the mic button, you got the cards, you got the fader. And that's about it. Visit us at bosschockstudio.com. Don't shoot, the tank is on the move, troops. The first burst from the back.